Hello, everybody. Welcome back to OCRP on Server 2 once again. We've had a lot of requests to bring the neighbors back, so we're doing exactly that today. Happy Friday and enjoy. That's the last box. All right, see ya. Thanks for taking care of my stuff. Later. My new place is 414. There we go. Got the GPS. My house is around here somewhere. Okay. It's up here on the right. What is that? Hey! No! No! What? Children play here! On the main road! <laughs> oh, jeez, oh, who is like... that? I, it, they must... Oh, they're moving in. Yeah, I it heard that... It looks like they're moving in. I heard that, uh... I guess everyone's moving in. Something must have happened here. I mean, I got this on a full Well, there's a big development in this area. Yeah. You know, they're just building up. Look at your grass, by the way. That's really nice. Thank you. Don't step on it, please. Thank you. Oh, okay. It's a lot yeah, better than I, I just don't, like, and, uh, I know we just don't want to really be that girl, you know, but, uh, need some improvement. What do you mean? It's, it's a little patchy. patchy. It's, it's a, a little, it's, a little it's patchy. Not bad. A little patchy. Yeah. It's not bad. Oh, it looks, it's not up to HOA standards, so. Oh, um, so, so we're I gonna add get... that. We're gonna add that to the list. Oh, okay. So I don't get, huh. don't don't get time to like unpack or anything. Well, once you take possession of the house, not really my problem. So you're you're now responsible for the condition of the house. So I'm just gonna okay. need you to. Yeah, again, no rush. But next Friday, this all done. Um, I think you have a bigger. You, you... Okay, listen. I'm, yeah. Okay. Can, can you hold my wine? Excuse me. Uh, hold my wine. I'm just, yeah, I'm sure. Thank Hang on. you. Sir! 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 Watch out, lady! Oh my gosh, he's backing out. Oh my gosh. Excuse me, sir. What do you want? What do you mean, what do you want? You're doing burnouts in the street. Yeah, I rented it. I can do whatever I want with it. You can't do that in the neighborhood, sir. This is a community. Yeah, I can. I rented the truck. I can use it how I want. Oh, you're, oh my gosh. You're my, this is my new neighbor. I'm your neighbor, by the way. Well, nice to meet you. I got stuff I got to do. Well, well stop doing burnouts. Or I'm going to call the police. Well, like, like I told you, I had paid a lot of money for it so I can drift it and do whatever oh I want God. with it. First impressions say a lot, sir. That's all I'm going to say. First impressions say a lot. All right. Not Good later. Luck unboxing. Jeez, what a... Here's your wine. Oh, thank you. Oh, you're sweet. Oh, excuse me. No, it's okay. <laughs> hey, lady. What do you want? Hey, who lives down the road that has the white picket fence? That's a new neighbor. I didn't get his name yet. Oh, I hit their mailbox and I took part of their fence out accidentally. Accidentally? You're, you're drifting this thing around. Yeah, I'm trying to get all the money out of it before I take it back. You are a menace, sir. You better stop. I'm calling the police. I'm calling the police. I'm calling the police. Hey, can hey, we can not? You... I just moved in and I, you know, it's supposed to be a nice neighborhood. What are you doing here? What? What are you doing here? Do I know you? Yeah, I know who you are. Well, you don't. You get a haircut? Yeah, it's me, Randy. Oh God. Why? Did You're you? You're not supposed to be around me. Did you just move in? Yes. Yeah, I hit your uh, hit your uh, mailbox in in part of your fence. What? What? On this I think house some right of here? it's in the front here. If you want a couple pieces of it, dude. Put what it, are you doing? You can put it back together with super glue. You know you're not supposed to be around me. Well, I mean, I just moved in right here, man. No. No, you yeah. gotta move, dude. I was here first. You gotta you move. You go to hell. You go to hell. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. oh. He just hit me. Hey. <laughs> That's my car. I just got it back from the cleaner. Stop Get throwing things here, in dude. my car. Get out of here, dude. Then stop throwing things in my car. You're not welcome in this neighborhood, dude. Get out of here. You you suck. You still driving that piece of crap car? 
window dude yeah. hit my windows yeah get out of here dude randy's such a piece of crap he just leaves the u-haul like halfway in the street and in the grass <laughs> <laughs> uh, wake up from my nap here Ugh. I almost slept in all the way. Yeah, I love living in Los Santos now. Yeah, I love Mirror Park. What is it, a dud? Oh, there it goes. Nice, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Mirror Park, whoa. Oh, that was cool. I believe that's he what he said, Randy. Randy. Yeah, Randy. Oh, hey, Randy. Randy. How you doing, Can... Randy? I'm Trevor Noel, Dad. This is uh, Deputy Kyle. Can oh you, yeah. Uh, What's you, up? Uh, step away from the fireworks for just a second. Yeah, hold on. It's gonna go off. There it goes. Oh. Yeah. Nice. Randy is so cool. Very awesome, Randy. Randy can is I, so I... cool. Yes, yes. Can we chat with you, sir? Yeah, you guys can talk to me. What do you need? All right, so we're trying to have a conversation over there, and uh, you're shooting out fireworks. Is, yeah, I, I just moved in. I'm celebrating because it's the nicest house I've ever lived in. Uh, that's that's very awesome. I believe there's an ordinance uh, oh, against fireworks. Oh, that crazy though. lady that was yelling at me earlier. Ma'am, ma'am, please, please, ma please stand over there. We're, we're taking care of this, okay? I think she was like, is I think she's like is, doing that, dude, or something, because they were like. We're like hanging out and having one and all that. Yeah, I believe she's part of like HOH or something, I guess. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, this yeah, I heard something really about the too much. HOH, but I've never dealt with one before. Officer, yeah. Shouting. Okay, sorry, I guess I was shouting. Um, So, yeah, I guess uh, she was saying uh, something about how you you were moving in with your U-Haul van. You started doing burnouts and stuff, though. Yeah, I mean, like, I, I was trying to get used to the gas pedal. The gas pedal's, like, really spongy in that thing, and it was, like, spinning the tires, and she got all mad and everything over nothing. Okay, and did you throw snowballs or anything no, at somebody? No, stupid dude, that, there's that guy from, like, I can't even tell you how many times that that man's been in my life, and, like, he keeps just showing up, and he's, like, he lives, like, down the street, and he threw oh. snowballs in my car. He threw snowballs at your car? Yeah, he threw snowballs, look. Come into the garage. I think there might be ice still all over it. Okay. I'll show you. Yeah, there's still ice all over it. You see that? He was throwing stuff all uh, over my look. car. Oh, yeah, I do see that. Okay. And I just well, I mean, got this car out of storage. You came over here trying to ruin it. Right. If it's just snow, it shouldn't ruin the paint. Um, Unless you just painted it. Um, But I don't... Notice the back window. Did he do that also with the broken glass back there? Or is that yeah, my eyes? Yeah, he was eyes? throwing things at my car. Yeah, it's like he, he like makes his own snowballs in his freezer and he throws them at me. He makes his own snowballs, so it was so it was more ice than snow. Yeah, it's probably what's damaging my car. And he said you had a history with him. Yeah, I, yeah, I've had a hit. He's he's a jerk. He's been around for a long time. When, I don't want to press he, charges Randy. or anything on him. I just want him to leave me alone. Okay. Right, that's fair enough. But yeah, I want you guys to make sure that you write this down because I've had injustice in the past where they don't care about me. Uh, rest assured, we we at the uh, Saint Jervis High Patrol do care about you. And so does the bank department. We were out for everybody. Well, I never had a problem with you guys. It's usually the LSPD that's screwing me over. I'll stop with the fireworks and stuff. I gotta go to bed early because I gotta get up for work. Just make sure not to fall asleep on us so we can uh, chat with you if we have any more questions, okay? All right, man. Yeah, no, I'm just hanging out because I'm gonna be going to bed. I gotta, I gotta return that van in the morning. Right. No, I completely understand that. I just well, don't want to throw in new house, ice though. at my car. You're gonna destroy it. And that dude's a p pathological liar because all he does is just lie to the cops every time about nothing. I don't do anything to him. Randy, uh, what is your last name? Newman. Newman. Okay. Yeah, it's Randy Newman. Common spelling. Yeah, I guess so. Uh, yeah, I think I think that's all we need for now. Do you have any uh, any questions for us? No, I don't have any questions. I just need to go to bed. But I want to make sure that you guys write it down because that dude's gonna do it again. I guarantee you. All right, do you have a way to close your garage door so he can't? Yeah, yeah. Whenever you walk discuss? out, it'll close. Okay, so I'll I'll go ahead and. Uh... 
Um, I'll still be on scene. If you think of anything else, just come out and let us know. And um, other than that, you're uh, you're free to uh, hit the hay. All right. Well, thank you. All right, Mr. Newman. You have a try to have a better night, okay? All right. Later. All right. And if you need us, just call us. <laughs> <laughs> they let you go? Me? Yeah. Yeah. I've been free for a while. I'm running up to the gas station to get something to drink. Yep. I'm just up here at the uh, LTD. I'm going to get something to drink. And then uh, head back home because I told him that I have to work in the morning. Get away from my property. Where are you? I'm in my yard. Don't worry about it. How can you see me? Because I'm looking through the crack. I'm on my property. Well, stay off of mine. I can, I can do what I want. You don't tell me what to do. You're creating all sorts of problems. This has nothing to do with you. You got so many violations out here, mister. Which trash day? Thursday. Thursday? Thursday. Okay. These bushes need to be dealt with. What's wrong with my bushes? I, I don't own the place. I'm renting it. Well, you got to tell your landlord. Who's All your right, landlord? Well, yeah, I will. Who's the, who owns the house? Who are you renting from? I'm not allowed to get that information out. I am. You're, I have level three clearance, sir, with the HOA. I'm the director. I, I have a right to know. I should probably no, know. No, the cops said actual... you're with the HOH. That's what they told me. You know, HOA. What is HOH? I don't know. Homeowners what? Homeowners okay, well, house. I'll, I will talk to the owner then. Okay. Good day. Later. Everything all right? Hey, Randy. Yeah. All right. So Charles doesn't want to press charges either. Um, okay. Sounds like you both just want to be left alone. Like you don't want to. You don't want to deal with Charles, and he doesn't want to deal with you. Yeah, my so, anxiety's like through the roof right now. I have to right, have a beer I, to try to knock it back down because he, they're being crazy. I completely understand that. So, my best advice for you is ignore that he lives two houses down. Just don't even think that he lives there. He said he's going to try to ignore that you live over here. He just wants peace and quiet. He doesn't want anything to do with you. He doesn't care that you live here or anything. He just doesn't want you to harass him, and he won't harass you. All right, yeah, I can do that. So, I mean, obviously it is past midnight, so make sure you're not lighting off fireworks or anything. And like you said, you got to go to bed early to take the U-Haul van back and stuff. So, yep. So yeah, if you can just uh, just pretend that he doesn't even live down there, just think of it somebody else who lives there. I think you guys will be both better off and you can bury this hatchet. All right. Yeah, sounds good. All right. Awesome. You have a great night, Randy. And we're going to clear out of here so we can get out of your hair so you can get some sleep. All right. Later, dudes. No problem. Have a good one. What do you want? Get out of here. Because I have to work in the morning and you're going to call the cops on me if I don't mow. Stop mowing. It's a doors violation. You're going to hell. What? Really? It's 2.30 in the morning. <laughs> Why is there a horn on that thing? <laughs> dude, it's it's 2.30 in the morning. Oh, the what do you me to? Dude. It's not your dude. I'm sorry. It's just what I say, man. Okay. I, that's fine. Well. Hey. He, he stripped <laughs> Oh, God. Stop it. What's the point? What, what? Get out of the way! I'm trying to mow. Two thirty in the morning. Oh, yeah, I'm trying to mow. Dude, come on. Move no out of my way! Dude, stop mowing. Ah. It's so late. If I don't mow, do I'm not gonna tomorrow. be able to do it tomorrow. I gotta work. Oh, you, you have, have a job. To work. Right Get off of my property! We're not allowed. We're Just, what is the, dude, come on. That looks amazing. I'm going home. Good luck, Why Anita. This ball? Why do you keep mowing it? Aren't you Good done? Luck, I gotta make sure it's not close. It's down the ground. 
Get out of my property! How long can he have this van parked here for? Three days. Uh, was it been one? It's been not even one. Hang on. Let me get my binoculars so I can see what color paint he has. Hopefully I don't fall through the netherworld. Cindy is the best. Oh, there he is. He's garage garage sleeping. Open. What a, he's sleeping with the lights on. What a psycho. Randy is the best. Whoa. What are you doing? You can't do that. You can't do that. Hey, don't mind me. What are you doing? And why can't I hear you? I don't like this dude. What was that sound? If you're around my house, get away. If you're around, you better come out. I have guns. I'll shoot you. I have guns. I'll shoot you. No, what happened to my car? San Andreas 91, how may I direct your call? Yeah, my car just got trashed. <laughs> that voice is Car so just got trashed? Where at? Yeah, I'm at 414 on Mirror Drive. I think my neighbor's trashed my car. <laughs> They threw snowballs at it yesterday, and today they destroyed it. Okay, sir, is that Eastmere Drive or Westmere Drive? Westmere Drive, I just moved in. All right, what's your name, sir? My name's Randy Newman. That's N-U-E-M-A-N? N-E-W-M-A-N, yes. What's a good callback number for you, sir? I don't, I don't even know my number. I just got a new phone. All right, and you said your car was trashed by snowballs? No, it looks like somebody took a baseball bat or something to it. Are there anyone, is there anyone you know may have done this? Yeah, probably stupid neighbors with a lady or her boyfriend or something. I just want police here now. This is an okay, injustice it, in my car's trash. Or the neighbor's boyfriend? I don't know. Okay, all right, we have units on the way. Just. Uh, Calm down and stay inside. All right, we'll have to get up. For, well, I have to go to work soon. Tell them to hurry up. They'll be there as soon as possible, sir. All right, thank you. Aha, there it is. Over here. They trashed my car. Who did, Randy? I'm pretty sure you know it was those two idiots over there. Come look what they did. I was sleeping last night and I came out to this. They destroyed it. Oh yeah, I do see it smoking. Yeah, they shattered Jeez, the windows. Oh mighty. Then you have your garage locked or anything? No, I forgot to lock it last night. I was so tired because I was talking to you guys so late. Okay. And I think they snuck in and did something. I don't have any, I don't have like a, a Bing or anything like that. TV or anything? Yeah, I don't have like a Bing doorbell or anything like that. So I don't have anything, any like, anything like that. Right. Okay. Let me, let me check if there's any fingerprints or hairs or anything left behind. Okay. Hey, I'll, I'll be right back. I gotta take the uh, the U-Haul back where I got it. I'm gonna I'm gonna check with uh, your next door neighbor, and I'm gonna check with uh, Charles. Hello, everyone. Editing Jeff here. I uh, just wanted to say that I thought originally I was going to uh, go ahead and edit the song that is about to play. Um, instead, I thought you know we might as well just let it go. So viewer discretion is advised. There are cuss words and stuff uh, happening here soon enough. Um, it's been a long time. But I feel like uh, if we didn't do it this way, it wouldn't have uh, hit the same way. So enjoy. Fuck my neighbor. He's a piece of shit. Fuck my neighbor. He can suck my prick. Fuck my neighbor. He can go to hell. Fuck my neighbor. He can go to jail. Fuck my neighbor, he's a stupid piece of shit. Fuck my neighbor, he can suck my dick. Fuck my neighbor, he's a stupid fucking prick. Fuck my neighbor, he can suck my shit. Yeah! Randy! <laughs> Air one is.
is here. <laughs> Alright. This one goes out to you, Chuck. Fuck my neighbor, he's a piece of shit. Fuck my neighbor, he can suck my prick. Uh. Fuck my neighbor, he can go to hell. Fuck my neighbor, he can go to jail. Fuck my neighbor, he now has a girl. Fuck my neighbor, he can rock her world. Fuck my neighbor, he's a piece of shit. Fuck my neighbor, he can suck my dick. Fuck my neighbor, he's a stupid prick. Fuck my neighbor, he can suck my dick. Everybody, why are you in a helicopter here? Uh, I mean... I'm trying to get Randy down from his vehicle. He said he was going to take it back to the U-Haul place and he stopped <laughs> Larry Barry of, uh, is house dancing and across the street. Music, so. Is he? Oh, he is. <laughs> you know he's on any type of alcohol, drugs, any type of influence. I know he was drinking a beer yesterday, but I don't think he was drinking when I rolled up. He just, I think he's having a mental breakdown. No, oh, he's Later. getting in the van now. I'm going to go return the U-Haul. Okay. Look at the there goes the guitar. <laughs> off the back. I'm returning it back here. Off place. of the roof was Dude, great. Dude, it was so away. good when I did that. Yep. <laughs> I'd have returned it. Now I gotta walk back to my house. Yeah, I returned the U-Haul where I got it. I told him that's where I was going. I had a peaceful protest in the street. And then I returned the U-Haul. And they're going to probably be like, were you drinking? I'll be like, I was having my morning beer. I may have narked on you and said there was drugs in the back of that you all. Oh, that's good. I was like, I don't want to be a narc. And then I narked on you. <laughs> that's amazing. Which there are none. It's an empty truck. Randy did not sweep it out. So he will be getting the charge for that from you all. I see the air unit over there still operating by the U-Haul truck. That's great. Pretty darn good. Somebody's at the door. Hello? Andy. Here, let me come outside. I can barely hear you. What's up? No, I completely understand. All right, so I checked over everything what uh, I'm going to beat your vehicle up with. So Here, come over here. I can't hear you. I'm sorry. Oh, you still couldn't hear me? Yeah, I guess I'll just have to. Here, let me get my umbrella. Yeah, you go ahead and get your umbrella. Uh, So I checked over... Uh. Charles property and made sure you know any any like baseball bat or anything what could incriminate him there is nothing what he has which uh, proves that he uh, attacked your vehicle okay so I mean like I said you can't just assume it was him I mean he wants he wants just to have peace with you it seems like he just wants to be left alone he wants to live his life and stuff I'm unsure on who did the damage to your vehicle I got I got as many pictures as I could. I'm hoping we can turn up with uh, some evidence. I didn't find any DNA or anything inside, unfortunately. But, uh, I mean, I definitely would advise getting like a CCTV and making sure locking your garage door and stuff like that. But uh, getting a, a ding uh, ring bell type thing for your door and possibly a camera out here just so you can uh, yeah, I'll you have to do anybody. that. I'll get a hold of my insurance company, but I know it was him. I know it deep down inside. I have a gut feeling about it. But I understand. I, I know you guys had a, a long history of beef, but I think he wants to bury the hatch in it. I think it would be a great idea for you to bury it also. All right, but I was just peaceful protesting. That's all I was doing, and I took the you all back like I said I would. No, that, that was completely fine. I... I just, you know, I was confused. I just didn't want anything escalating. I didn't want him to try to cause trouble with you, and I didn't want you to cause, like, I didn't want a fist fight, pretty much what I didn't want to happen. So I got more units out here for that. All right, yeah, just keep an eye on him, because I don't trust him at all. No, I completely understand that. Um, we're just trying to get everything resolved so you guys can live a peaceful life. I understand you just moved in here, and you want to just, you want to enjoy your new home, and I, I, he said he moved in four days ago, so he's just trying to, you know, live his life as well all right but i'm gonna i'm gonna be taking i'm gonna be handing all the evidence i have of your vehicle over to the investigations 
hopefully they can figure out uh, what completely happened with that and we'll get it uh, secured for insurance for you as well. All right, I guess I'm just out again. No, I completely understand, Randy. It's it's a it's a very terrible situation, but as much as we can do is you know is try to avoid each other, like we stated yesterday. Try to avoid each other. If we get if you get any concrete evidence with a uh, uh, any video cameras, then we can uh, prosecute him for you know vandalizing and stuff like that. All right, yeah, I'll let you guys know immediately if something like that happens. All righty, Randy. You be safe and uh, definitely get some uh, get some rest and hopefully you have a better night. All right, later. Yeah, have a great night, Randy. <laughs> well, there you go. Yes. You uh, you got you got away from it because they don't have any hard evidence. Mm-hmm. But I knew that was gonna happen. And uh, <laughs> I don't have like a ring doorbell, like a they called it a ding. I don't have a ding yeah. doorbell or anything like that. So there was no, no uh, video footage of it happening. It's it's good too. Like my character's got a shaved head, and I get yep. to the car, so no fingerprints, no hair. Nothing. I was like, this is perfect. That was good. I told the cops, I was like, he did this last time. He beat his own <laughs> car up and claimed I did it. <laughs> yep. We'll have to do it again. That was fun. Oh yeah. Neighbors are not done. No, nope. I'm past so drunk from wine in my backyard. <laughs> <laughs> Later. OCRP. Bye. OCRP. Bye. Bye. Bye.